guys, it's Blair, and today we're going on a scavenger hunt. First run. thing on our list is moss. So we want to start looking in cool, damp places that are darker, so like in the shady area. Next on our list is grass, which I'm sure you can find pretty much anywhere. This are twigs, so you want them to be about the size of your pinky finger. Try not to break them off the trees because that tree is still living. For small pebbles, you might want to look in a sandy area. Um, don't go on the road though, because that's dangerous. Try to find a green leaf. Try your best not to pick it off the tree and find one that has already fallen. soil or sand. So if you're near a beach, you can go get some sand from the beach. Um, you can find dirt on the ground where you normally would find grass too. But before you dig a hole, make sure it's okay with your parents. <music> For a scavenger hunt, you have everything you need to make your terrarium. If you really want, you can go and you can find a tiny gnome or a tiny Lego man or some type of character or any small plants that you can add to your terrarium. 